everybody, I'm back today with an exciting unboxing. This is my first order from Treasure Studio Arts. And I'm excited because I've never ordered from them before. And they, have, they use mounting film adhesive, so I'm pretty stoked on seeing what that is like. Because I've never done a diamond painting that uses mounting film. Mounting film adhesive? Mounted film adhesive? This took a little while to get to me, which is understandable because of the virus. Um, there was an issue with the tracking number where she sent me the right tracking number but the wrong link. Um, so it looked like it was like getting delivered in like Alabama or something like that. And I was like, no, why did my package go to Alabama? But it was just the wrong tracking link. So the person in Alabama actually received their package the same day I got mine. So if that was you, Congratulations. This is just annoying packaging, but let's get through this. Okay. Let me clear this crap off my desk here. I don't remember what the painting's called, so hopefully it says that somewhere here. Oh, Wildlife by Maria Abig Abignali. Abignale? Abignali? Something like that. This was like the one that caught my eye on their website and I was like, oh, I have to have it. Let's take a look, it comes in this box. The painting is kind of squished, but that's okay because it just looks like it's the outside. We'll get this stuff out and then we'll look at everything. Is there anything else in this box? Nope. Okay, so this is the box that it came in. DIY fashion diamond painting. <laughs> Throw that on the floor. Take a look at the kit. It comes in this nice little branded organza bag. Um, there's a little knot tied. Oh no, is it an actual knot knot? No. Watch me struggle to open this. Come on. Okay, so it comes with this white tray. Two rectangles of pink wax. A clear pen with a, does it have the number with like a, I don't know how many placers that is, nine, seven? Multi-placer, a set of pink tweezers, or not a set, but really pointy pink tweezers. Good enough to stab your best friend with. Just kidding, don't do that. Um, one of these squishies, really good for your fingers, and then a set of additional multi-placers. So it looks like a six-placer and a three-placer, which is perfect because I did need a new three-placer, because mine is dying. And I was going to buy an everlasting tip for it, but I'm still juggling because I'm like, oh, I don't know, is it worth the money? Should I just keep replacing them with plastic? I don't know. If you have an everlasting tip, please leave a comment and let me know if it was worth it. Let's take a look at the canvas. Whoa. Pretty heavy. Ooh. Okay, so it is squished a little bit on this end. Whoa, it's big. It's big. The drills come in baggies, which is pretty good and handy. And there is a sh inventory sheet, which is great. Let's take a look at the canvas first. The canvas feels so different. Let's see if I can fit. I can't fit most of it in the screen. I'm just gonna do as much as I can fit in the screen and there is a glare, sorry. Okay, so we're currently on my floor. Let me just open up this canvas so it's nice and pretty for you guys to see. So again, 
This painting is called Wildlife by Marie Abignal, Abignali. I'm sorry, I can't pronounce your last name or last names in general. On the left hand side here we have the schematic and on the right hand side here we have the schematic as well. At the very bottom there is Treasure Studios art information, so their website, their social media, and then 30% 30, 30 extra drills, customer service, number one customer service, and then money back 100% guaranteed. So if you're not happy with it, apparently you can get 100% back, which is amazing. Here is the beautiful canvas. I'm really curious about the um, mounted adhesive. So let's take a look at that. Wow, it's very sticky. Very sticky. Take a look at the drill field. So we're like in the antler area here. The drill field looks easy to read, except there are some black symbols on a darker background, like a dark blue, so that might be difficult. Um, I will use a light pad though. If you don't have a light pad, I would recommend getting one. It's not like a super must, but it will make things so much easier for you if you do work on canvases that have dark on dark. Uh, diamond painting fields, canvas fields, whatever, you know what I mean. And here is another look, a close-up of the thumbnail again. It measures 50 by 65. So I know this is sideways for you guys, but this is the only way I can put, fit it in one frame. So there's the canvas. She's really pretty. I'm really excited about this. It's 35 colors, and what else can I tell you? The symbols look all right. I mean, let's take a look at the schematic. So see, like, F is in white, and it's on a dark background, so I don't really understand why, like, number six here, it's black on a dark background. Like, I would maybe just change those to white symbols on the background, because these are really kind of hard to see on the canvas and can play tricks with your eyes. But we do have the DMC numbers along the side here, which is amazing. And again, it's 35 colors. Now let's move back to the desk and look at the drills. And we're back at the desk. So let's open up these drills. I don't know if I'm gonna take all of them out just because they are packaged really nicely. Um, doesn't look like they're in any sort of order though. No, so I'll pull out some really nice, some of the nicer colors and show you guys. Here is the inventory sheet and it's printed in color, which is fantastic. I know before they're printed in black and white, so cool that they finally have color and they listen to people's reviews about them, who like people were suggesting, hey, this should be in color. So here, is the side of the sheet here. Thumbnail again. It's round. And then their contact information. And it also says here, you can see it. Please make sure that you check all colors and diamonds are supplied. If you have any issues with this diamond painting kit, please contact us via email or use live chat on website or Facebook. So that's helpful. And again, here's the schematic, so you can keep this for handy reference while you're diamond painting. Oops. And then let's take a look at some of the drills. Something that's easy to look at the quality. Let's take a look, ooh, purple. Purple is my favorite color if you didn't know. If you didn't know, now you know. So I'm just looking at the drills for like the sizing, if there's any um, weird discrepancies like any knobbly bits as people call them or side, extra side plastic pieces, whatever they are. 
doesn't look like there's any issues <laughs> besides this floaty guy who decided to jump in the wrong bag. in there. I really like that they come in baggies. That saves me time on kidding up. This is like a really, really bright orange. Probably just looks normal orange on the screen, but it is really bright. And these drills look like good quality again. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with this order. I can't, I don't remember how much it was. Um, but I, so yeah, I'm pretty happy with this order. I mean, I don't remember how much it was. I think it was around 40 or 50 Canadian and shipping was like $10 US, $9.50 US, I believe. It did take a while to come. I'll put on the screen here, um, the information on when I ordered it and when the actual date when I received it. But yeah, it's pretty nice. I'm super excited about this. It's not going to be the next diamond painting that I work on just because I am finishing um, my Mary's Diamond painting, but it will be one of the orders that I do work on coming up, but just not the next one. I want to do like a smaller diamond painting. So those are the drills. And I'm really happy that this sheet came in color. That's really helpful. So the last thing you want is an inventory sheet that comes in black and white. So yeah, let me know in the comments what do you guys think of this diamond painting? Have you ordered from Treasure Studio Arts before? Do you like them? Do you not like them? Um, leave a comment and let me know. And please subscribe to my channel. It will really help me out. It's free. All you have to do is hit that subscribe button in the bottom right hand corner. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!